And welcome back to Let's Play Dave the Diver. Alright, so last time we got everything we need to head back down to the glacial area. Uh, before we go down though, can I upgrade any of my weapons right now? Mmm, no, it looks like we're gonna need some materials to get these upgraded. Yeah, I feel like right now the sniper rifle is probably my favorite gun so far. I don't know if it's worth crafting any of the elemental versions though. I don't know. I feel like with the sniper rifle, damage is the most important thing. You don't have enough ammo to really do, like, elemental damage. Opal, giant trevally fin. Okay. Uh, I'll just keep an eye out for materials while I'm down there. Alright, before I go down, let's stop by the Sea People Village. I have a couple of things I need to do there. I should probably also eat before I go down any deeper. Also, okay, yeah, we can not warp down to the collision area from here. So that's good. Basically, we can always stop by here before we go down. Alright, uh, let's go check out the farm real quick, because I know my stuff is done there. Oh, wait, we also have a side quest over here now. What's up? Ah, you're still sick. Alright, well, I guess we're gonna need to cook for him again. Oh, before I go, can I buy anything good here? Mm. I don't need any of this stuff at the moment. Also, it's kind of expensive. I need to earn myself some more money. Probably by actually doing those side quests I picked up a while ago. Maybe one of these days I'm gonna grind up a little bit of money. Oh, I guess I could also race seahorses. That could also work. Uh, I have more seeds. But yeah, at some point, I need to raise myself some more money down here. Unfortunately, my above water money isn't really good below water. It would get all wet and sticky and not work. I guess that's probably why they use coins instead of paper money, it seems. That would make sense. Well, then again, it does seem like there's just, like, paper and stuff around, so... They probably have some special things they can use underwater that won't, like, immediately turn into mush. Horsehair crabs. And of course, actually we're going down there right now anyway, so that still works. Oh, do we have to, oh, we have to go back and talk to Otto for this? Eh. You know what, we're going to be coming back here every once in a while, so I'm not too uh, concerned about doing it right now. I just want movement speed, honestly. Thank you. I will never say no to movement speed underwater. Alright, let's go down to the glacial area and find out what's going on down here. So now that we're nice and warm, hopefully we won't have too much trouble staying down here. First time in the glacial area. Let's go. Oh, I should also use my extra oxygen tank. Okay. Alright, so it looks like the suit is working. Good. And it is a new area, so that means that's a narwhal. Oh, that, uh, the range on this thing is kind of crazy. Oh, God. Oh, my God, you hurt. Okay. This is a new area, so I'm getting you to be a bit more care- Oh, my God. How am I already almost dead? Okay, note to self. Uh... Glacial area kind of dangerous. I might want to consider upgrading my suit. Oh no. Oh god, I'm. Hold on a second. Is there any O2 around here? Oh, is that O2? Oh my god, give me that. That is not O2. I'm dead. Well, um, yeah, uh, let's try that again. I'm going to keep that. Turns out, got to be a bit careful down there. Holy crap, that narwhal completely destroyed me. I 
I got... <laughs> oh, I also lost all of the, uh... Stuff I harvested down there. Okay, now we know. Okay, before I go down then... Just curious. I can't upgrade my suit anymore, never mind. So I need to start thinking about upgrading my air then. Just for the, like, extra oxygen. That was with boosted oxygen, too. Alright, I'm buying this as a healing item. Let's try that again. Oh, I guess I can, You know what? I'll check out the farm when I get back. It's not that important. Okay. But now I know. Uh, things hurt. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna need to upgrade my oxygen tank just to take those hits. Oh, I lost my food buff, too. Well, oh, I could have also talked to Otto while I was up there. Alright, we'll do that to, uh, what is it, tonight. Alright, so no more just, like, screwing around. If we see a narwhal, we go for it. For example... It might also be good to start thinking about maybe, uh... What the? It might also start be good to start thinking about getting that next upgrade tier for my guns. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, we're good, we're good. Okay. You know what? Take this thing up. I'm kind of surprised these drones worked down here, but... Oh, wait, that was an objective of mine. Nice. I'm using this. But yeah, it might be time to start thinking about getting that giant trevely. Actually, I can probably just look that up, can't I? Giant trevelies are in... I believe they're in the upper areas. Hmm. Okay, you know what? I'll look it up later. What is that? Oh no! Bomb. Oh, I missed. Darn it. Oh, I'm out of ammo too. Okay, uh, well, I got one bomb off. Is there a. Oh god. Okay, no, this is not a good idea. Ugh. Hit and run tactics, let's go. If I can find myself some ammo, ooh, ammo, ammo, ammo. Yeah, I definitely need to upgrade my weapons. Oh, okay. Why is it so scary down here? That's the second fish I've caught, apparently. Okay, oh, hey, uh, bulk help. Oh wait, that's right, we were looking for that. Okay, so I guess we couldn't have gotten that recipe without coming down here then. Hmm. Looks like we're also going to need to start thinking about upgrading our harpoon gun again. These fish are weirdly difficult to catch. Alright, please tell me there's some O2 around here for me. Please tell me we can refill our O2 down here. I haven't seen anything yet. But then again, I also haven't gotten past the first section. You know what? No, we should probably get the fish before it leaves. But yeah, I might- oh, an Arctic Kong. I might have overestimated my preparedness for this area. Uh, what are you? Ooh, harpoon chip. Ooh, a level 4 one, nice. Also, I'm kind of- no, wait, no, we have been upgrading a harpoon gun, never mind. This one makes sense why it's like- It makes sense why we can only get these upgrades underwater. I still hate that minigame. Like, you're kind of... It feels like you're supposed to do the greens, but if you just aim for the greens, you will not succeed the first time. You have to get at least, like, one or two yellows. Also, yeah, the fish down here are weirdly hard to catch.
All right, still need to upgrade my knife more. Yeah, you know what? I think I might spend a little bit of time just getting weapon materials as well. But hey, we should at least have some new fish for uh, the fish farm when we get back up. Ice fish, okay. Are you new? You're definitely new. Gelatinous snailfish, ew. I don't think I would want to eat any fish that's called gelatinous. Just me. Also, olive oil. Kinda of surprised that hasn't frozen over. I guess oil is a lot harder to freeze than uh, water. Whoops. You know what, you can go. I have the maximum suit upgrade, so I shouldn't have to. Why is that glowing? Well, whatever it is, I can't get it yet because my knife isn't good enough. There are so many new materials down here too. These are definitely gonna be needed to upgrade my stuff. Man, Bancho's gonna be so happy with all these new fish we're bringing him. Some nice haddock, which is not that rare of a fish, actually. I'm kind of surprised we had to go all the way down here to get that. Uh, can't go this way yet. Also, I just realized something. There is an escape route down here, right? I haven't actually seen any escape pods yet. Also, I ran right into that. That's fine. I am digging the music here, though. It's nice and it's nice and calm and peaceful, despite the uh, very hostile sharks and narwhals. Okay, so there's a current over there we can't get through yet. Probably need to shut it off at some point. I think I definitely need to start prioritizing my knife upgrade so I can just actually start getting the stuff down here. It seems like we're past the point where the game's gonna give me a free... Ooh, Kirby Moth. It's gonna give me a free, um... Free pickaxe. More curry blocks. Okay, I kind of... Maybe it wasn't the right move to have all my people go out to get curry blocks. We might not need that many curry blocks, to be honest. Is there anything over here? Is this a dead end? Nope, dead end. Got you. Plant of Haddock this run. Ooh, an octopus. That's new. Oh, that's a... It's a flame weapon. Do I want that? Not really. Oh, I got poisoned. Darn it. I got the... I got it, but I also got poisoned along the way. What? What is this? Oh, it's a warp... Okay, so no, there are not escape pods down here. We need to use magic mirrors to get around. Oh, it looks like we could warp back to the sea people village from what I saw there. Although, I'm assuming these are one way. Yeah, we can go back to CP Boo Village. I'm assuming those are one way, though. There's mm, there's no way they're going to let me set up so many fast travel points, right? Because they're all, like, frosted over, so I guess they don't work. Black pepper. What is this? I thought this was oxygen earlier, but... Oh, you know what? Hold on a minute. Let me try something. Okay, no, that did not work the way I thought it would. No. 
Oh, is this a photo opportunity? Hold on. This might be a photo opportunity. God. A jellyfish that massive would freak me out. Let's get a photo. Alright, so... Capture with Narwhal. Okay, I see now. Wait for it. That was easy. God, a jellyfish that... Lions mean jellyfish. I don't know. I said before, jellyfish freak me out. I don't know why. I think it's the complete lack of a face. But there's just something about jellyfish that completely unnerved me. Especially when they're that big. Also, yeah, the deep sea is a very mysterious and scary place. I don't think I have, uh, what is it called, that, the fear of the, o of the ocean. But there is just something about the ocean that is still f super freaky. Especially the deeper you go. Like, open, like, uh, what is it, shallow waters aren't too bad, those are all pretty familiar stuff. It's when you start getting into the deeper areas where there's no, like, light, is when things get really strange. Also, this thing is really hard to catch. Come on. You don't have that much health left, do you? There we go. Oh, at some point I need to get my some more drones. Honestly, the drones are probably my least, um... Are the lowest of my priorities to upgrade. I have enough carrying capacity that I can just carve things up. Oh, things are, uh, things are changing. Wait, what do you mean we can't go further? Oh my god. Okay, so we spent all this time getting a warm suit, and now it turns out that it's too warm. Either that, that's like a geothermal vent or something. Either way, we can't go down any further that way, so let's go look around a little bit further up then. Also, I'm catching as many fish as I can for my mission. And for the hope that we get a bunch of road to put in the uh, fish farm. Alright, so I've been over here already, right? I think this is the dead end. Yeah, this is the dead end. Um, Where have I not been? I've been to the left. I guess we'll keep going right until I run across anything. That isn't another narwhal, because if I run into a nar another narwhal, I might just make a run for it. Well, then again, I have a better uh, harpoon gun now with more ammo. I could probably take it. And I have an emergency air tank, too, just in case. But yeah, that narwhal completely destroyed me. Uh, oh, what is this? Black coral. Despite its name, it's white. All right. Yeah, there are always those weird names where they're named in, like, a certain color, but they aren't that color in real life. Usually there's some weird reason behind it. Like, they might look that... I did not need that oxygen. Whoops. They might look that color, like, at some point in their life cycle, which is why it was named that way. Or it's, like, eggplants. Where they're called eggplants, because if you've ever seen, like, an immature eggplant, it looks exactly like a chicken egg. Before it gets all purpley and long. At least, the, like, the uh, eggplants we see in-game. But yeah, that's- I think that's the reason why they are called eggplants. At least in America. I think they're called average averagines in England? Oh yeah, cat food. I don't know if I want to feed the cat this cat food. Like, I know it's free cat food, but at some point, you probably don't want to eat that. Uh, got another warp point over here. Let me see what's over here before I keep going further down. Oh, wait, is this another... Oh, wait, no, there's nothing over here. I would think that it's something... It looks like that's blocked off, though. Might be for later. That's just back to the surface. Okay. Uh, one more area I want to take a look at before we get out of here.
Also, I still have plenty of space in my inventory. Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Okay, that's one downside about using the electric harpoon gun. I forgot that the splash damage can kill other fish. Four more fish for that mission. Alright. No, 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 no. I see something. Oh my god, that thing is big. Is it hostile? I don't see the arrow above its head. That usually indicates hostile. Nope, there it is. Nope, move, move. Oh my god, that thing hurts. Alright, this is fine. Oh. Oh, that wasn't too bad. I just had to use all my ammo and take a hit. Mm, do I have enough space? Holy crap, that thing is 20 kilograms. Uh. Okay, it might be time to start thinking about heading back. Let's go a little bit further. I have a spare oxygen tank if I need it. All right, looks like we're going back. Yeah, we're going back to the uh, hot area I can't go around yet. Let's take a look at what's over here, and then I'm getting back to the mirror and getting out of here. So what I've learned today is that very dangerous creatures, and yet surprisingly, some pretty normal uh, fish live down here. This basically is just like a cold, like an arctic environment for fish. Oh, what is that? Hold on. Oh, right, inventory. What is this? Jade marble. Oh, I can probably sell this. Uh, I'm gonna... Um, problem is, I don't have much room in my inventory. I don't want to drop any of the new fish I just got, either. Even if it is 20 kilograms. You know what, it's just money. I can make money just when I'm doing side quests and stuff. Anyways, looks like this area is blocked off. I think that's everything I can really do right now. And my movement speed is completely gone, so I think it's time to leave. We'll be back. Oh god, this is gonna take a little while. Uh, the mirror was over here, right? But yeah, this area is pretty, but there are things that are blocking our passages. So we can't go into the high current area yet, and we can't go any deeper because of the uh, heat. I feel like I'm missing something. I'll we'll probably take a look around more once I come back. Uh, take me back up to the boat, please. Alright, we got some row, it looks like, so that's good. Yeah, it... It's a giant... That's literally called a lion's mane uh, jellyfish. Ooh, nice. Good payday, though. Okay, we'll go back down tomorrow. Um, Before we go to the restaurant... Let's go check out our farms. Get everything taken care of there. I think tonight's gonna be a pretty standard night at the restaurant. We'll harvest these so that the field can expand tomorrow. Just a little nighttime farming. You know how it is. Oh, this is all the garlic I planted. Yeah, this is all the garlic I planted for the other night. Well, I don't think we're gonna need garlic for a while. Anyways, Otto. Yeah, we need to catch a horse uh, horsehair crab. Crab trap, okay. 
<laughs> oh, those are what those, like, rocks that we've been seeing are. And of course. Lumber, scrap, iron, rope, tiger shark. Why a specific tiger shark tooth? I think I have all that, right? Yeah, I have all that. Let's, uh, let's get that crap trap. Okay, so we can start getting crabs now with that. Like I said, I'm still surprised they're introducing so many new mechanics this late in the game. Alright, what do I need? Let's get like a couple of carrots, a couple of onions, some cherry tomatoes, some beans. I have no more space in my menu, so that's fine. Oh, this is a storage box. Okay, not gonna lie, I thought that was like a shipping box or something. I've been so used to like farming games having a shipping box that looks just like that. It never really occurred to me that, yeah, we probably do have a storage box here, huh? Okay. So field should be up, or uh, patty should be upgrade tomorrow. So let that keep going. Let's go check on the fish. Alright, so how is our glacial area looking? Nothing right now because we just put in all the eggs. Anyone overcrowded at the moment? No, surprisingly all of our farming areas are pretty empty. Alright, let's wrap up the episode with a little bit of sushi. Hi there! Our... Are you okay? We're... It's assumed this is like a subtropical trop or tropical area. Yeah, 27 degrees Celsius. At night. This is definitely not freezing. Oh, you just want something spicy. Also, I feel like... If this all happened after you ate those... I think you might have some problems, uh, thermoregulating yourself. Mm. Alright, so hot pepper tuna. Mm. <laughs> also, I'm kind of surprised we haven't made anything spicy. We, no, we definitely have some spicy stuff on the menu, right? Okay, um, well, I was gonna open up for the night, but we should probably go do this first. Actually, you know what? This might be a good place to wrap things up, because it looks like we're about to start another side quest. So, next time on Let's Play Dave the Diver, uh, we're gonna do our service for the night, and then probably head back to the glacial area. Actually, no, we might just take a break from going down for a minute. I kind of want us to go see if I can grind the last of the materials I need to upgrade my gun. Because, um, yeah, things hurt down there. So, till then.